Hello, I'm Roddy, and we're coming to you today from this behind the scenes at the Tennessee Institute of Cosmetology. I'm going to introduce their owner, who is Paula Cook. Paula, come on out. Paula started this school. When did you start this? I started in the year of 2006. And why did you start it? Well, it's something that I always wanted to do. Um, there wasn't really a whole lot of opportunity in this town to, to teach, so I just decided to open my own school and, and take it from there. Okay, so we're, we're in the classroom right now. Is this the first step? This is the first step. When you start in class, you'll be in class for about eight weeks. Eight weeks, mm -hmm. and that takes you through your book work, and then from that, where do we go? Well, from there, we go on out, and we start working on our mannequins, and then out onto the floor. How long is the a student here at the school? It takes them roughly 10 months to complete the course. Uh, like I said, for eight weeks, they're in a classroom setting and working on their mannequins before they're able to come out on the floor and work on the public. Okay, so we're going to go and see what they go from classroom to working on the mannequins, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, Paula, we've come from the classroom, which is the first part, which you said is eight weeks, and now we're in the part where they do mannequins. Mm -hmm. Now, in a given day, they come in, they do their classroom, and then they come here and spend half a day here? Right. In the mornings, they have their classroom part. In the afternoons, they have their practical part, where they work on mannequins, and sometimes they work on each other. Now, how far are they into the class when they start working on each other? Uh, probably about two weeks. Okay. About two weeks they start working on each other. And then where do we go to? And then we're going to go on up towards the front where I start bringing them out to work on the public. Working on the public. Okay, mm -hmm. let's go. All right. Okay, Paula, we've come the third step. We've come from the classroom and we saw the students working on the mannequins. Now we're out here where they do manicures. Right. And you said something about hours. Let's talk about how many hours they have to have to come out here. Right. Uh, the full course is a 1500 hour course. Okay. Uh, after 100 hours, I can bring them out and let them do manicures and pedicures. Um, they can work on each other to begin with and then I'll let them work on the public. They have to have 300 hours before I can bring them out on the floor to do any hair. Okay, now with the manicure, is that put pretty much probably the easiest thing that they learn? Well, it's not necessarily the easiest thing. It's just um, as far as the teaching goes, it kind of starts breaking them in you know, getting them used to the full cosmetology program. When we come back, we're going to move a little further with here at the Tennessee Institute of Cosmetology. Now we're where we Okay, this is our facial room. Okay. Uh, in here we do waxing. We wax okay. eyebrows and, and any part of the facial hair. Um, we also do facials. It's uh, about an hour process. It's very relaxing. Okay, Paul, we arrived at the last step. Mm -hmm. Classroom, we worked on, your students worked on the mannequins, then they went from the mannequins to doing nails, to facials, and now we're at this department. And what is this? Uh, this is where they actually get to come out and work on each other and the public. Okay. Uh, they have to have 300 hours before they can come out on the floor to work on, on somebody. Mm -hmm. What about job placement? I have a lot of the area salons that will call me up that are needing some students, you know, needing some stylists rather to, to come and want to know if I can recommend some students, you know, to fill the positions there. So I try to send them with where they go. How does a student get started here? Um, the only requirements that they have for the state of Tennessee is uh, a driver's license, a social security card, and either a high school diploma or a GED. Thank you very much for being a part of this back behind the scenes. You talk, we've talked to Paula Cook. She is an owner and instructor here at the Tennessee Institution of Cosmetology.